Hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, my fellow creative designers and content creators. Welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel. And in today's episode, we are going to design this beautiful election flyer. We are in Ghana currently, and this is also an election year, and the tensions are high. Therefore, election flyer, political flyers, and other things is being demanded. Therefore, I take this opportunity to guide you on how to create a beautiful, very attractive, simple but very, but very nice election flyer so that um, in case you have any politicians in Ghana or you have any politicians somewhere in the, around the world and you are being asked or they request you, de you, so, um, sorry, you, you, you design an election flyer for them then you come to my channel and then just get inspiration from here and design so basically this episode is going to be for election flyer for one of the leading presidential candidates in Ghana that is John Dramani Mahama and we are going to use his images the NDC's logo and NDC's colors just to create everything so without wasting much time please join me in the other side of the video and let's dive into the tutorial so please take your machine launch the Photoshop and let's begin from there Please subscribe to this channel, like, share, comment so that YouTube will comment this channel to a lot of people. I love you. I'll see you in the classroom. Bye bye. Okay, so control N to open a new document and then just name it JDM, JDM, which means John Dramani Mahama 2024. Press enter. Everything is okay. I'm going to set here to transparent or basically okay let's set it to color white and click on create it's for social media handles and that is all this is the and then all the resources that i use for the design are here i'm going to share it with you for you to download and then if you want to practice it you download and then use them for free okay so we start working on the background and the first thing we drag is we drag this into photoshop and then we release it nicely please wait for it to load don't pressure it loading sometimes depend on your system on your machine your some of the machines will help you load quickly and faster so this is it click on ok then kindly have patience with it let me hold shift and then stretch here okay let me stretch here i just want press alt and then stretch to fit this side and let's see let me hold shift again and then enter here good good i'm just beginning i'm just liking what i'm doing guys please subscribe to this channel like and share so that youtube will also recommend our channel to a lot of people and this is it this we went on to the next one which is this drag this in photoshop and then you release it nicely like this and again wait for it to load always wait for it to load please wait for it to load now it's load so cl click on ok and then all right so i think after this one we need to draw draw a beautiful rectangle this rectangle nicely like this and then hold here bring it down a bit and then give it color red yes give it color red that is the colors of the ndc nicely press enter then sorry hold out and then drag it to this side and then let's scale it like this so this must go up a bit on T to select it and then push it up again like this and then this should also go up on T and then reduce here like this and then go and change this side to green color because the ndc's colors are red green and i think white yes that is it so push this sorry push this down a bit push them down a bit so that we have a white something upstairs to put our logo and details over there all right all right all right all right then the next thing is you drag this and drop it in photoshop and then wait for it to load guys always wait for it to load please whilst it's loading please subscribe to this channel like and share and let's grow the channel together so drag it like this and then press enter and then move it up like this ctrl t to scale it up nicely like this uh, let me just put it this way and then hold shift and stretch here 
and then you stretch here again stretch all sides good and then let's get to the blending option and set it to something like let's see we'll just want the red to show though and i think this is awesome this is awesome for now okay so we'll go to the blending option and then set it to overlay i think overlay is awesome overlay is awesome the, this color red must come down a bit yes color red must come down a bit so i think it still have to sorry i said red the green have to come down a bit Past the red too have to come down a bit and then we stretch it up stretch it up stretch it up and then control t and then move it up like this is awesome it's awesome it's awesome it's awesome and that is great that is great that is great that is great and i think this side add layer max and then be on the brush too and then clear some parts like this yes clear some part like this so that the green will show yes the green should show clearly at least it must be visible because of the colors we are putting together so all this and this in one group control gene to call it bg so background bg one good that is it so our first background is set okay and i think we are going to open this up and then go and add hue and saturation so click here and then we search the hue to minus seven and i think i begin to like it and then we are going to bring a first image which is this drag it into photoshop and then release it and wait for it to load and guys always wait for it to load so it's downloading and then we check it like this drag it nicely like this and then scale it up press enter and then we are going to remove the background just convert it to layer layer like this go to the properties panels if your properties panels is not showing over here i'll show you how okay so photoshop has removed the background for us quickly and if your properties panel is not showing go to windows and then search for properties and then click on it and it will be added to this side it will be added here and that is it so we are going to set this image to multiply we are going to set this image to multiply nicely 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 and then let's see if we can reduce the opacity a bit we just want it to be inside like that yes it should be inside like that let's convert it to smart object again and then rasterize it good and then control t to scale it up yes we just want the image to be inside like that it should be visible but not too visible then it means we need to still maybe make here 50 and good i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome so this becomes a full background and then let's go and work on the image um, the logos drag this logo and then push it here like this right rasterize then press w on the keyboard w on the keyboard to activate the remove background logo or the quick selection Okay, so that is it you right click it then pick the magic one two and then hit here and then press delete now the background will be deleted control d to deselect it t here control t and then reduce the size down reduce the size down reduce the size down and then t again and write the the um, the party name which is the national democratic congress so the national Democratic Congress. Okay, and then let's change the color to color white. Let's change. Sorry, I said color white. Let's change it to color black because that side is white, so it needs to be on. Um, 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 it should it should be black so that it will be visible. And let's change here to. Let's change here to something like extra bold and then change here to uh, um, um, okay i think here should be extra bold rather and then here to to be not to uh, like bold and yeah then the last one should be the uh, 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 okay let's close here congress nicely like this and Put this and this in a group control g and then this is the logo one all right so let me go and drag the second logo the second logo is a 
the same shape I created and I did um, um, some features with it and I had the second logo. So where is it? Logo 2, where are you? This and that. I just push it. And where is the test? Where is the test? Where is the test? Okay, so the second logo 2 is set and which is it? Control G and then I'll call it logo 2. Logo 2 nicely and then the logo 1. Let's push it. Use the arrow key to push it to the side. Then let's go and bring our guide. Go to view, go to guide, and then new guide layout. And then let's set here to 6 and then activate here and set here to, to 6. And I think let's add some margins and clear existing. And I think this is awesome now. This is awesome. Let's click on OK and this control T let's center it this way awesome and i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome so let's put all this one in a group and call it logos all right all right all right all right all right all right so again let's check it out let's check it out we have this nice image over there drag it and then release it in photoshop nicely like this this is the image we use for the main image then let's scale it up like this Let's scale it up nicely like this. It's an awesome, beautiful image we had online. And you can also check it up. And then he has a lot of images, but um, this is the image that caught our attention. In case you do have some different type of image or photos of him in which you can use it, you can also um, um, send it to us and we'll make good use of it. And then maybe if there is the need for us to change the image we will change it ASAP. We will change it ASAP. So remove the background. Okay, so the background is done removing, and I still need to stretch it up like this nicely, and then to cover the entire space. Either this is okay, or guys, just keep stretching till you get the nice edifice or anything you want. And below the image. Yes, below the image, T on the keyboard, and then go and write here. This main theme is building Ghana we want. So building. Building, con enter, control T to select it, and then scale it up like this. Make it huge to cover his back. And then go here and check here to something like minus 80 or so, and change the color to white. Yes change the color to color white T on the keyboard ctrl t again and then scale it up nicely like this and i think it's too big 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 it should cover this and this guys you know what how we do it already you know how we do it already we don't make sure it doesn't exceed some part therefore let's obey our own rules let's obey our own rules so move it up a bit so build sorry Push it up again and then alt and then drag it down and then building Ghana. So double click it and then write Ghana. All right, control T to select it and then scale it up. Just scale that up and then bring it here and control it and let's center it this way. Good. And then let's go and pick the building and center it that way too. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. The Ghana should go up a bit. And then drag this down. Then type we want. Sorry, we want. Control T to select it and then reduce that side to down. Reduce that side to down. Reduce its size to down. And I think this is awesome. So building Ghana we want. Building Ghana we want building Ghana we want. We work on the image thoroughly. We work on the image thoroughly. We work on the image thoroughly. Yes. Using to pass lab. Using to pass lab. So if you don't have to pass lab, please, I'll give you a link for you to download to pass lab. Yes. And, and because we don't want to use the image and then go through the process so that the, the video will be too long, just let's delete this image and go and bring the image in which we have already worked on. Yes. Let's drag it here and then bring it down here nicely like this and it will load to this side 
good so in the image is ready yeah we used to pass lab to work on the image we used to pass lab to work on the image thoroughly yes that's why you are seeing this nice image so let's put this and this in a group and then control gen to call it text one text one because you are going to add a lot of text control gen again and then call this image or image yes good so this is the image just be naming them so that you don't go overboard whenever yes just organize your files organize them organize them and it's very very necessary very very relevant when it comes to graphic design in case you are to make corrections on it then you just know where to go exactly so just pick your rectangle too and then draw a beautiful rectangle like this nicely and then change let's close here to zero change here to color red and then let's open this side and move here to let's see 100 and see 100 to is so 150 good and this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome control t and then we'll it this way yeah we'll it this way and then push here like this move it inside like this and i think no no so let's hold uh, okay 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 i think that side is awesome that side is awesome and let's see uh, uh, uh okay okay i think this is awesome so brought it here like this control j to duplicate it and then we thought it this way sorry we thought it this way and then con let's change this side to let's change this side to maybe color white also double click this side and change it to green let's make it green first and then and then maybe the next one so mean red have to come up first because of the exact thing we did and then double click this side control t and then bring it this side a bit and then double click this side and then go and make it color white yes 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 nicely 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 and then we are going to bring the names we are going to bring the names this is the name of the man john dramani mahama and we have his name as in logo his name as in logo so right click rasterize size and then click w on the keyboard hit here and then press delete and then this side will be deleted hit here to delete it hit here to delete it and then maybe let's zoom it out let's zoom it out and delete the irrelevant part hit here to delete it hit here to delete it and then control d to deselect it and then pick this to and clear this side yes push it down a bit and then press delete and that side is gone so move it this way again press delete and that side too is gone control d to deselect it and then zoom it down zoom it down zoom it down zoom it down and then let's come let's double click this side double click it and then choose color white color white for it and that is it okay so we just brought this details that is the name as the logo and we type the name over here dramani mama so we have the main john dramani mama as president and then just that is it and guys let's put all this one to in a group and then call it this this and select or control j to put it in a group and call it name and shape yes it's made up of name name and uh, shapes yes that is this shapes we created yes that is the shapes we created and that is it 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 and i think we are saying done to it that is me we are saying done to it but we are not done com entirely okay and i think we are almost getting done to this but let's check here and then clear some part away so b then let's clear this part away so that um 
the logo will be visible yes we want the logo to be visible and that is it that is it that is it that is it and let's see let's see let's see control alt shift and e put everything in a group and then right click it convert to smart object and then go to this filter and then go to camera raw filter and let's see if you can boost the whole design up let's see if you can boost the whole design up guys let's boost it up and please subscribe to this channel like and share and this is for educational purpose only whilst we are designing we are we don't mean to maybe associate ourselves to any political party or any other things this is for tutorial purpose only it's for tutorial purpose only we are not endorsing any political party or we are not endorsing anybody but just for a tutorial's purposes only thank you very much for understanding i know how ghanaian politics are so please let me issue this disclaimer before people start tagging me with politics yes i have a lot of flyers for politicians and you can check them out guys if you boost it up and you don't get what you want just reverse it back and i think let's see let's compare the two the before and after and let's see let's okay let's release it and let's see if it's okay and what do you think is this okay or not guys let me know in the comment section below how you feel and this is how we say goodbye to this flyer please subscribe to this channel like and share comment and then let's grow the channel together i love you and i'll see you in the next tutorial bye for now peace shalom